Now Frizzell, back at a rate of knots. The Knights want another one. The fans Way want another send one. This off, now we've got this. Uh, Luttrell. Luttrell Mitchell. Get off. Get off. He's off to the pit. The Rabbitohs may potentially lack the presence of their accomplished fullback, Latrell Mitchell, as well as winger Tane Milne in a crucial upcoming match that holds significant importance in their efforts to secure a spot in the finals. During an intense match between the Rabbitohs and Knights in Newcastle on Sunday, South Sydney suffered a 29-10 defeat. As the time was running out, Mitchell's sudden lapse in judgment resulted in him being temporarily removed from the game for striking Tyson Frizzell in the back of the head with his elbow. Fans across social media were quick to voice their opinions on Luttrell's brain explosion, with many labelling him the biggest grub in the NRL. He's of no value to his team the way he is at the moment, physically, mentally, or in his knowledge of game or lack of knowledge of the game. And he hasn't got the knowledge to play fullback. He hasn't got the intensity to play fullback. So Luttrell's on a real learning curve. I'll be very interested what the next 18 months brings for this young man. I'm, I'm worried about Luttrell and his football and unless he is mentored in the right way by the right people through this period, it could all come unravelling for him over the next 18 months. Judging by what I'm seeing now, he's not ready to play NRL football the way he is right at the moment, and certainly not to play that position. We all can agree that Latrell plays his best footy when the scoreboard is on his team's side, but when he has his back against the wall, patience isn't really Latrell's best quality, and he easily gets frustrated over the most trivial things. Do you think the fans' criticism is fair and warranted? Will Luttrell's dog act cost the Rabbitohs a finals appearance? Let me know your thoughts in the comments section below.